<laughs> this is really hard to do. A kangaroo. Is it a kangaroo? Oh, I, I, I know you. Kia ora team, so I am so, so excited to be chatting to the incredible Jacob and Bluey ahead of their incredible tour next year that you will get the chance to see. So firstly, Bluey and Jacob, a massive kia ora from everyone here in New Zealand. Oh, thank you so much, it's so great to be here. It's great to have you here, both of you here. I thought quickly we could actually teach you a little bit of New Zealand sign language, oh, Bluey, yeah. if that's okay. So this one is just kia ora, so you just, Move the hand away, so that's kia ora. Perfect, Bluey's got it down. Talk to me about Bluey's Big Play. What is it all about? Bluey's Big Play is a brand new show written by Joe Brum, who wrote every single episode of Bluey. When you watch it on TV, it's only seven minutes long. Whereas Bluey's Big Play is 47 minutes. So it was a real challenge for Joe to kind of look at a bigger story arc. And that's what he's done. And it's traveled the world. It's gone to America, it's gone to Europe, gone to Asia, all across Australia. And we've saved the best to last. <laughs> And we're coming to New Zealand next year. Very well said, <laughs> very well said. Wondering if we could get a little bit of the inside word sure. as to just quietly, what Bluey's like backstage before these big shots? Well, well, Bluey is the ultimate professional. Oh, okay. You know, she's always doing a vocal warm up, so that's why she's silent here today. She's voice resting. Yes. One thing she always demands is that she shares her dressing room with Bingo. Which makes complete sense. So what are the two of them like together backstage? Are they playing any any pranks? Well, if they do anyone? play pranks, they only play it on one person, and that's Bandit. <laughs> and maybe that is slightly what they do in the actual show as well. So if you come along and you can see what pranks they prepare for Bandit. I'm sure there's plenty that'll be on the cards. What kind of games does Blue like well, to play they, before They, they on love stage? to uh, warm up before they go on stage with a good game of keepy uppy. A balloon, you've got to keep it off the ground, and they can play that for hours. I bet. So we really got to tell them like, to wrap it up. The show's got to go on, put the balloon away. Well, I was wondering if perhaps Bluey and I could play a bit of a game right now. Would that be okay? Yeah, sure, what were you thinking? I was thinking we could play a game of charades. Oh, Bluey, perfect. should we do it? All right, let's do it. All right, we have got some charade experts with us ready to take on the challenge. Team, are we ready to play charades? Yeah! All right, I think it's only fair that we let Bluey go first. What do you guys say? Yeah. Okay, perfect. All right, Bluey, here is your first charade. You have to act out. Got it? Perfect. All right, away you go, Bluey. Hatting. Clubbing. What do we think? Hungry. Bowl. Hungry? Is it jumping? Not jumping. It could be someone, rather than it could be an action. Might be Jackson. <laughs> Is it socks? Oh, could be close though. Austin? Bingo? Getting closer. Mum. So, so close. Dad. So, even closer. One more, Nathaniel. Bluey. Yes, Bluey. My go now. All right. Okay, let's see if I can do it. Mini Bluey. Okay, all the count three, one, two, three. Bingo! Yeah, you got it. Now we're getting on a roll. Now we're on a roll. Okay, Bluey, here's your next one. Okay, this one. Okay. Charlie, what do you think it is? Jumping. Jumping? No, leaping, leaping. Not quite. Nathaniel? Moon jumping. Not moon jumping. It is jumping. Is it what kind of animals jump, perhaps? A kangaroo. Is it a kangaroo? Yeah, it's a kangaroo. Nice work, Lila. Me next. <sighs> okay. A shark. Not a shark, Lila. Any other guesses? Oh, I've got it, I've got it. Alligator. 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 Al what is it, Charlie? Crocodile. Crocodile is correct. Nice work. You guys are starting to pick it up. Louis, here is your last charade, okay? This one right here. Yeah? Okay. I mean, this is a good one. Dancing. Looks like a type of dancing, maybe a type of dancing you do on the water, perhaps? What do we think, team? Surfing. 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 It's correct, it is surfing. Nice work. Okay, last one. This is a tricky one to finish. Okay. Boy. Eating. eating ice cream. Not eating ice cream. Scraping butter off and eating it. Close, getting close. Spreading peanut butter on bread. Just a different type of spread. Oh, oh. Peanut butter on toast. It is not peanut butter. Jam. It's not jam. Oh, <laughs> right away. Oh, no, 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 no. <sighs> mm. 
<laughs> this is really hard to do. Okay, I'm just gonna give you a bit of a clue, okay? What's like the opposite of fruit? Or, uh... Veggie. Yeah, okay. So think veggie balls. <laughs> Okay, uh, pass it to Nathaniel first. Eating a salad? Not salads, no, it's still spreading. On the toast. Avocado on toast? It's, oh, it's another great, great guess. People either really like this or they really dislike it. And there's Mama? two versions. There's a, a New Zealand version, and then there's an Aussie version that I think Bluey might prefer than the New Zealand oh, oh, version. Oh, 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 I know this and I think you're very close there. What was the word you just said? Marmite. What's the Australian version of it? <laughs> Oh, I, I, I know you way Veggie mate. Yeah, we got it. <laughs> we we got it. Okay, based on the charading performance, who do you think deserves to get a pie to the face? Do you think it? Do you think it's? Do you think it's Bluey? Or do you think it's me? I think we should bring Jacob in to decide, actually. Jacob, who do you think we pied after that charade performance? Well, I have to fly back to Australia with Bluey, and I, she won't talk to me if I send the pie to her face. So, sorry, Chris. Said you might let you down. It did let me down. It's gonna have to be Chris. Do you guys agree with that? Yeah. Three, two, two one. <laughs> There we go. Thank you very much, Jacob. My pleasure, Chris. That, that actually suits you. Thank you look you. great. What do you think? I see that. It looks like Santa. He looks like Pinocchio with the big nose. <laughs> <laughs> Jacob and Blue, we have one more thing. Um, just to say thank you for coming to Old Tidal. We thought we'd have a little bit of a, a gift for you to take back to Aussie before you come back to New Zealand. So get that. You couldn't come to New Zealand without your oh. very own New Zealand rugby ball. Bluey. So that is for you. There you go. Your own New Zealand rugby ball. So what do you think, team? Do you reckon Bluey could be a future Blackburn? Yeah. yeah. 100%. Well, Jacob and Bluey, thank you so much for hanging out with us. What do we say, team? Thank you, Bluey! Well, thanks for having us. And we'll see you uh, next year in April. There you go. We'll see you then. Bye! Bye! <laughs> Subscribe to the One Now YouTube channel and we'll give you a puppy. Chris, you can't say that. Subscribe to the One Now YouTube channel and I will come to your house and gun you. Absolutely not, Chris. Subscribe now because we've got awesome videos.